it's night three of the Democratic National Convention, and I'm back checking in with Fox News watching my dear friend Laura Ingram. And um, she tonight is most upset that the Democrats are fun. Like, that's what she's complaining about criticizing them for. She's particularly upset that the Obamas last night were funny. Like, how dare they? They also flash to this, like, correspondent that they have on the floor. And then he goes up to this group of delegates from California and asks them if they're mad at Nancy Pelosi for forcing Joe Biden out of the race. And they kind of say nothing until eventually one of them says, no Fox News, we're not mad. And then he goes back, sees a random man sitting completely alone, asks him if he's a delegate. The random man goes, no, I'm just trying to get some pictures. Are we live? And the Fox News guy is like, oh, yeah, we're live. And then the camera pans up because they can't find anyone to talk to them. Then Laura had on Rod Blagojevich um, to comment on, you know, all the crime in the city of Chicago. Rod Blagojevich, who famously went to prison after being impeached and convicted of a whole bunch of fraud and extortion and famously trying to sell Barack Obama's Senate seat as the governor of Illinois, was there to comment on the crime. If you're wondering how he got out of prison, Donald Trump commuted his sentence. So I bet you can guess whose side he's on now.